Jekyll, Jekyll, Jekyll. So Jekyll is basically a new Inter Milan player. What do I think of this entire situation? Now before we get onto my personal opinion, don't forget to hit that subscribe button ladies and gentlemen because if you like Roma, Mourinho and want an opportunity to follow this club as an English language all you need to do is subscribe to this channel. We are getting so close to 1000 subscribers and it is a dream of mine. My objective is to reach 1000 subscribers before my school starts which is the 7th of September. Also please like this video, it supports me so much and without further ado let's get onto my personal opinion. Now, once again, this is my personal opinion and there will be many Roma fans out there which will think the opposite of what I think. But this is THE Simon Show and my name is Simon. So, criticize me if you want in the comments but also please, 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 if you think you agree with me, comment down below because I'm very curious to read all of the comments and responding to all the comments as well. Now, I love Jekyll, don't get me wrong. Jekyll has been one of my favorite players for Roma, if not my favorite for the past six years, from the day he arrived. Because I knew from the very start that he was the person, the striker which Roma needed. Now, Jekyll came six years ago and in these six years, he achieved a very big goal, as well as bringing Roma in Champions League spots, giving Roma that opportunity to play a Champions League semi-final, which then they lost against Liverpool, but um, that amazing comeback against Barcelona. Dzeko achieved something personal, very important at Roma. He was the third player in the entire history of this club to score the most goals, after Totti and Puzzo. So, it's amazing what he did in six years of time. Now, I understand if you want to leave because this club is not, in these past six years hasn't won anything. I understand you want to leave because you want a new opportunity, you know, you've been at this club for six years. I understand you want to leave because Inter Milan sold Lukaku and it is a very good point for you to replace Lukaku and that means that you are going to play every single match. But the way you left Roma is very disrespectful in my opinion because the 15th of July Roma played a friendly match against Debrecen winning 5-2 where Dzeko scored a double and after that match in an interview he said well journalists can you please stop talking about Dzeko leaving Roma I've got my faith back with Mourinho and I don't want to leave I'm concentrated about next season after you said this, two weeks later, you cannot go to Inter Milan because it's disrespectful to us. Because us Roma fans are not stupid. You can't play with us. We, Roma fans, don't have morons written all over our foreheads. And that is the thing which I don't like about Dzeko. Because you've been at this club for six years and you said that you're interested and you want this club to win trophies with Mourinho in this season and then two weeks later you accept Inter's bid. Now, it's as if I have a girlfriend who's pretty, I am with her, then a new girl, which is a tiny bit better than my girlfriend, asks me, approaches me and says, do you want to go out? And I dump my girlfriend to go out with someone who is a tiny bit better, a tiny bit more beautiful than them. That's not the way you do it. That is not the way you dump a girl. And in this case, it is not you, the way you dump a club, which has been your home for the past six years. You know, I feel like us Roma fans loved you every single moment of your career at Roma. And you cannot leave like this, especially after you said that you want to continue at Roma and you're interested, you, you want to play, you got your faith back with Mourinho. And after two weeks, you accept a bid at Inter Milan. You can't do that. And that is what I find disrespectful about this move to Inter Milan, you know, because for many, many times in many transfer market sessions, there has been rumors of Dzeko leaving Roma, Dzeko to Chelsea or Dzeko not to Chelsea. Dzeko is very close to Inter, but then you refused. Dzeko is very close to Juventus, but then you refused. Dzeko is very close to Chelsea, but then you refused. And we all wanted you to stay. But at this stage, you know what I'm going to say? Just, just leave. Because we understood that you do not want to play for Roma anymore. And we want players who will fight for this club until the very end. So 
As much as many times I said, Jekyll, please stay, Jekyll, please stay, Jekyll, please stay, I believe that this is the perfect timing for Roma, for a new start, for a new start to the striker. And just, just, just leave, go away from us. Because you do not want to play for Roma, and we understood this. Because once again, I repeat, us Roma fans don't have more unwritten all over our foreheads. Plus, there are positive and negative views about it. Obviously, getting away from Roma is a good economic good news for us. Because Dzeko was the player at Roma who earned the most. 7.5 million every season. At Inter Milan, he is earning 6 million. But the real question is, will he play as a first striker? Because if I were Inter Milan... Replacing Romelu Lukaku, which is way better, scores more goals, he is way younger, and is way more physical. Dzeko is not a good sub substitution to replace Lukaku. And in fact, the one second Inter Milan by Duvan Zapata or someone else, Dzeko is out and he's screwed. But at this stage, I believe Roma need a new start. And it is a good opportunity to restart all over again with strikers. Because we understood that Dzeko doesn't want to stay. Because he's been, he's been very close to many clubs in the last few years. And in these last years, he hasn't been performing that much. You know, last year, a striker, Roma striker Edin Dzeko, barely scored 10 goals with very two, a defensive midfielder scoring more. So, as much as many times I wanted you to stay, just, just go away from Roma. Because it means that we can earn a lot in, when it comes to economic factors. Because 7.5 million is a lot of money. But we can experiment with younger players. And I never wanted to film this. And I want to say thanks, Ted and Jekyll. Thank you for everything you did. But the way you left us is very, very disrespectful. So ladies and gentlemen, comment down below you think. I'm very curious to read all of your comments about this situation. Is Dzeko really, really a good striker, which Inter Milan needs? Or is he better that he stays at Roma? And let me know if you think that this move was very disrespectful, especially the way he left Roma. Ladies and gentlemen, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. We're getting closer to 1,000 subscribers. And as I always say, I'll catch you in a bit. Simon, out.